Now, the question on a lot of people's minds is, will we see coronavirus aid? Well, 25 News reporter Olivia Leveda has those answers. Americans could see another round of coronavirus aid. It was known even at the time that the CARES Act passed that further legislation would probably be necessary because the CARES Act would keep us going for a couple of months. On Tuesday, House Speaker Nancy Pelosi revealed a more than $3 trillion coronavirus relief package. The extensive bill would provide aid to essential workers and a new round of $1,200 cash payments to individuals, increased to up to $6,000 per household, even adding a 15% increase for food stamps. Pelosi spoke on the need for additional aid just last Thursday. I kind of followed the CARES model of $150 billion for state and local will have to do very much more than that. And Democrats and Republicans around the country, governors, mayors, county officials, etc., cetera, uh, have been calling out for this funding. Last week, 25 News asked Senator John Cornyn about the possibility of another direct stimulus payment. I think it's possible. That was really sort of viewed as an emergency uh, lifeline to people that didn't have any income coming in and uh, the front door. Meanwhile, they had, they had the necessities of life, putting food on the table and, and so forth. Associate Professor of Political Science, Dr. Jeffrey Dixon, just finished teaching a course on politics and the economy. We did was a short unit on the current economic crisis and the stimulus package that Congress passed back in March. He says if passed, the most significant part of the bill known as the HEROES Act would be providing direct assistance for people who can't make ends meet. The bill continuing through January, the $600 per week boost to unemployment benefits. Because we have double digit unemployment. The House is expected to vote on the new coronavirus relief package as soon as Friday. However, experts say the Senate is unlikely to pass a bill like this one without some major changes. Olivia Laveda, 25 News. Olivia, thank you. The HEROES Act also includes a $175 billion housing assistance fund. That's to help pay rents and mortgages. It also throws in a $75 billion for testing.